hello friends welcome to my youtube channel so in this video i am going to show you top 10 tips and tricks of this device if you are new in this channel please do subscribe my youtube channel and press the bell icon for more tech videos so let's just get started the first hidden feature of this device how to hide the notch display for this go to settings then tap on uh, display then tap on full screen apps then tap on three dots on the top right corner then tap on advanced settings then turn on this option now the notch display is hidden if you go to the home screen now you can see notch display is hidden if you want to go back to the normal one then again go to settings tap on display then tap on full screen apps tap on three dots on the top right corner tap on advanced settings turn off this option then go back to home screen now you can see the full screen display is here so, so simply in this way you can hide the notch display in this device so the second one floating camera shutter so using the floating camera shutter you can move the uh, floating button anywhere on the screen then you can easily take a uh, photo using the floating shutter button for this open the camera then tap on settings on the top right corner then scroll down here you can see the option shooting method tap on it so here you can see some option press volume key then floating shutter button palm show palm turn on this option for floating shutter button then go back to your camera now you can see floating shutter button is here if you tap on it it will simply take a photo okay you can see the photo, the photo is capturing and you can move this floating uh, shutter button anywhere on the screen and you can using your convenience you can take a pic, uh, move the sh uh, floating shutter button anywhere on the screen and you can easily take a photo using this floating shutter button so the third one show pam to take a picture okay for uh, using uh, if you take a selfie then just uh, show your palm in front of the camera you can take a picture if you enable the option for the palm to take a picture for this again go to your camera tap on the settings on the top left corner then scroll down tap on the shooting methods then uh, turn on this option show palm then go back to our camera then turn on the front camera and just show your palm now you can see this capturing photo is captured just show your palm in front of the camera it will analyze your finger palm and it will automatically take your photo again i will show you simply it will take a photo so the fourth one home screen in landscape mode now you we can uh, enable the home screen in landscape mode for this go to the settings then tap on a display so in this page you can see the option home screen tap on it then turn on this option rotate to landscape mode then after that go to your notification panel and here you can see the option portrait turn on this option then go to your home screen then just you can see now the home screen is in landscape mode if you rotate the screen then it will automatically rotate the home screen also so simply in this way you can enable the home screen in landscape mode so the fifth one flash notification when you receive a new notification then you can uh, enable one flash notification using your camera or use using your screen to enable the flash notification go to your settings then scroll down tap on accessibility then scroll down tap on advanced settings so in this page you can see the option flash notification so here you can see two options when you receive a new notification if you want to enable the camera flash then you need to turn on this option and if you want to uh, when you receive a new notification if you want to bing, blink your screen then turn on this option okay so simply in this way you can enable the flash notification in this device so the sixth one change lock, lock screen shortcut when you lock the device then you can see these are the shortcut in the long uh, lock screen this is the uh, phone button and right side camera button you can change the lock screen shortcut 
according to your convenience you can change the lock screen shortcut now i will show you how to change the lock screen shortcut for this go to settings then select the option lock screen then scroll down here you can see the option shortcuts tap on it so here you can see the option left shortcut and right shortcut if you tap on left shortcut then in this page you can see all the application from your phone you can select any application so here i am going to select the application whatsapp now you can see left shortcut the whatsapp is here now i am going to change the shortcut uh, for the right shortcut tap on it and you have to select any application from this list so here i am going to select the application instagram now you can see uh, whatsapp is at left shortcut and the instagram is at right shortcut now i am going to lock the device then you can see the change whatsapp and instagram are the lock screen shortcut in this device so simply in this way you can change the lock screen shortcut in this device so, then the seventh one one hand mode if you feel the screen of the device is very big you have to use the one hand mode to enable the one hand mode go to settings then scroll down tap on advanced features so in this page you can see the option one hand mode tap on it then turn on this option okay then just swipe down at the middle of the home button now you can see the one hand mode is here if you want to move the screen to left side then tap on the arrow button and simply tap on the arrow button you can move the screen you can use this as your phone okay if you want to disable this one then turn off this option now the full screen is here then if you want to again enable the one hand mode turn on this option just swipe down at the home button you can see one hand mode is here so simply in this way you can enable the one hand mode in this device so the eighth one split screen and the pop up view so for to enable the split screen you can use the two applications at the same time for this go to the recent tab and in this page you can see all the recent applications that you opened up so each and every application on the top here you can see the app icon if you tap on it then here you can see some options so from this list you have to select the option open in split screen view now you can see this application is in split screen if you want to again select the application then select this one now you can see two applications in sin split screen you can use two application at the same time okay so to enable the full um, pop up multi window for this again go to the recent tab then select the app icon then select the option pop up in open in pop up view now you can see that application is in pop up view you can open more than uh, one application in pop up view okay again i will show you you can move the pop up window anywhere on the screen show you open in pop up view two application is in pop up view okay so this is the eight tip the hidden feature of this device so the ninth one sleep app you can uh, select the application that will be run in background that you are not using for a long time for this go to settings then scroll down tap on device care okay then tap on battery then tap on app power management then here you can see the option put and use the app to sleep turn on this option then tap on sleeping apps so here you can add the application that you want to uh, run the application in the background okay for this tap on add button and from this list of application you can select the application that you want to run in background if you want to select the facebook then select this one tap on add now you can see facebook application is here and this uh, will be run in background okay so so this is a sleep application uh, sleep apps so the last and the tenth hidden feature of this device reduce animation actually when you open any application then you can see one animation now i will show you how to enable the 
how to reduce the animation in this device for this go to settings then scroll down tap on advanced features then scroll down here you can see the option reduce animation turn on this option now when you close the application and when you open the application now you can see there is no animation it will directly open the application okay now you can see there is no animation directly opening so simply in this way you can reduce the animation in this device so these are the main tips and tricks of this device so hope you guys enjoy this video if you like this one please like and share and don't forget to subscribe this channel for more updates thank you for watching thank you bye bye